did you decide to start this podcast together? Take it away, Corinne. Uh. <laughs> well, we had been working uh, as a comedy duo called Sorry About Last Night for several years, and then I got dumped by the former love of my life uh, in a Panera Bread, and I was having like just like an epic breakdown for about a year. A lot of crying. A lot of crying at, at my house. Christina's apartment. <laughs> I was like, girl, uh, you would be all right. Yeah, it was not good. And then I kind of started using stand-up to heal myself, but it still wasn't really working. And I kind of had this thought. I was like, what if I go back and interview every guy I've ever had... Uh, uh, sex with or had a relationship with and kind of like learn John Cusack style like what I was doing wrong uh, and I thought it would be like weird to do it alone so I pitched it to Christina because she was already my comedy partner and I thought we would compliment each other well yeah so she texts me and she goes we should do a podcast called guys we fucked where we just interview guys we fucked and I was like Yep. <laughs> yes, we should. And then the and rest here is her story. Oh, Are you gross. hesitant? <laughs> we'll just cut that part out. And off. then I hate, the guys I hate myself fuck for saying podcast that. ended here at Moon Tower. <laughs> and our Sorry. last guest was Mad Bella so. <laughs> Were you hesitant at all about the name? Were you just like. She was like, I wasn't. No. No. I was very, I was very sure. Like, I, I literally wrote it as a note in my iPhone, and it sat there for like months. And I kept going back to it, and I was like, I think I mentioned to to Christina mm-hmm. once, just kind of like we we mentioned a lot of ideas to each other, and then we kind of let it sit. And then I, a couple months later, I I brought it back, and I was like, I really, really, really think that we should do this. Yeah, if we sit on an <clears> idea and we keep going back to it and back to it, that's when we know we definitely need to do it. And then that was yeah. I mean, my mom, I hid the title from her for two years. <laughs> And, uh, How'd yeah. How did you pull that off? She doesn't know a lot about the internet. I mean, she does some. Uh, we had a deal long ago that was, uh, you don't Google me, and then you won't yell at me, and it's fine. Right. <laughs> so so that was that was already in place, so I knew that she wasn't going to kind of go looking. So And she didn't listen to podcasts, but then, you know, she found out, and I blamed it on Corinne. I was like, well, Corinne picked the title. It was her idea. <laughs> but I didn't even know that part. <laughs> totally cool with it. 